It has been one of the top stories on Click2Houston.com. Tonight, we are learning new details about why police and federal agents raided two Houston poker clubs. Channel 2's Jonathan Martinez live at Prime Social off Westheimer near Voss with why that establishment says the business was perfectly legal. Jonathan. Yeah, Dominique, and ordinarily this parking lot would be packed and a lot of people would be inside playing poker. But following a raid here and at another location just down the road, both places are shut down and nine owner operators are facing serious charges. But the folks here tell us everything is on the up and up. On its Facebook page late Wednesday night, Prime Social apologizing to customers for any inconvenience and say they'll be closed until further notice. They, along with the Post Oak Poker Club, now shut down after being raided following a two-year-long investigation, according to the Harris County District Attorney's Office. In a statement, the DA saying, quote, poker rooms are illegal in the state of Texas. We are changing the paradigm regarding illegal gambling by moving up the criminal chain and pursuing felony money laundering and engaging in organized crime charges against owners and operators. Players are not being targeted. Nobody seems to know anything right now, so that's kind of why I came over here to try to find out. Poker players showing up to Prime Social instead finding a parking lot filled with undercover officers bringing out computer hard drives and more. According to the DA's office, prosecutors are contending the defendants made a profit from illegal gambling. If for two years they've suspected they're taking a rake, then why did they come in two years ago? They don't take a penny out of that money. A spokesperson for Prime Social says the poker club is hardly operating in the dark and has even done lots of charity work in the community. I just don't believe the guys that I know have done anything wrong. According to Chapter 47 of the Texas Penal Code, gambling is against the law unless you're in a private place, no one profits from hosting the game, and it has to be fair, giving everyone a chance to win. And this evening, we did call around to other poker rooms across the Houston area. We spoke to at least one who told us they heard about what happened here and at the other location. They're telling us they plan to remain open unless told otherwise. We are reporting live tonight for Southwest Houston. I'm Jonathan Martinez, KPRC Channel 2 News. Thank you, Jonathan.